Hey guys, what's up? It's Gotcha here, and I am bringing you um, some new news on MCV. Um, so some of y'all might have read that yesterday they're they're gonna add, like the whole game's gonna be kind of based around like auto fire, and so like everyone was kind of like freaking out about that, saying the game's gonna be awful. Um, I agreed with them too. I, I thought that was really dumb of them. Um, and I said they're gonna be adding the the shoot button in the future, which is, I was like, this game is gonna suck for three months and then it might get good. But um, uh, a Q and A got released from like Touch Arcade and one of the lead developers of uh, Game Loft, and it basically said that there is gonna be like a shoot button that you can toggle on at the uh, bottom of the uh, picture that's on right now. It says. Plus, for more hardcore fans, I think it means uh, players that aren't new, <laughs> um, we plan to provide an optional shoot button on the HUD, and we also plan to support controllers in the future. So, um, I guess, I don't know, I'm not sure how the auto shoot's going to work, if it's going to be like MC5, kind of like aimbot kind of stuff, or if it's going to be like, I don't really know any other game that does that, because it's not really a good idea. But I guess we'll just see how that plays out. Hopefully they realize that they should remove it. Or maybe, maybe it will be good. Who knows? But um, there's some more screenshots here. Okay, so here's the main menu. Uh, this is, I guess, where you start. Because um, there's no campaign. So we'll probably just jump right into the multiplayer menu. Alright, uh, we'll, we'll, start, we'll start on the top left of the screen. And just kind of dissect it from there. Uh, so we have the home. That's where we are. I'm not sure what that's. Um, I can't tell if that's like a skull or like a body or I'm not really sure what that is and a probably the clan system thing uh, the third one right there um, we have levels and then two types of payment systems the one you can earn in game and the one you can buy with your money probably um, and you have the store right there I'm not really sure what's in that um, as you can see, you have clans right there, so I'm not sure how the system's gonna be, and you have your name, obviously. A little bit over to the right, you have the settings, messages, and achievements, I'm guessing. Alright, and right under that, you have your, um, Bronze League, and then 800 trophies. So, I'm guessing that, um, the higher you are, the better the league. Um, you have the battle now button, so I'll probably just take you into the fighting screen. Uh, you have your leaderboard, league, and then contracts. Those are those will probably be like daily and weekly, and then um, uh, and then just another random one. Uh, you'll probably be able to earn a few things from those. It'll probably be things like kill 15 people or you know stuff like that. Like it, it is an MC5. Um, and then on right below that, you have the um, cases. You have a four-hour one, an eight-hour one, and a four-day and four-hour one. Um, and so I'm not really sure what those contain, but um, hopefully nothing too big to worry. Um, it ruins the game where, where you can pay for them. Um, but they said there's not going to be any pay-to-win stuff. I'm going to put that screenshot up right here. Alright, so right here, um, the question was where they're going to draw the line between skill-based competition and um, pay-to-win aspects, uh, something MC5 kind of failed on, so um, the response was kind of vague, it uh, doesn't give me too much confidence <laughs> for the game, but um, it, it doesn't really say much, it just says how there's going to be skill-based matchmaking and so, uh, I think that is a, not the best answer we could have gotten, but hopefully um, MCV doesn't turn into MC5. Um, if so, that'd be pretty unfortunate. Alright, uh, here's the next screenshot. Alright, so here's kind of where the you assign your guns and agents and everything, um, that menu. So, I guess we'll just start from kind of the uh, left side of the screen. You, you have your player there where... Uh, I guess that is what you either equip armor or which agent you want, um, and then your guns. 
So the each um, character has like an ability in um, that little lightning bolt in the floor right there. A um, there's a, those are called it's like the power core system where you get like a special ability and it goes up to ten, and so it, I guess that means it will take four. And then you have your um, you have your gun, and then alternate action stab. I'm not really sure what that means. And then. Right under that says training, so I'm not sure what that's gonna be, but uh, maybe it's like a firing range type of thing like we saw in some uh, recent console games. All right, and now on the top right of the screen it says ghosts and then pro agent. So I'm guessing there's gonna be like different levels of characters that you can get. Not really sure how that's gonna work. Um, and then its role is kind of like it's uh, just its class. And so this one's assassin. And uh, you have the uh, agent XP, so I guess you earn that from playing games and then you have upgrade in the bottom right um and so that uses the gold yeah so uh i guess that's how you rank them up you earn it by playing and then you use your gold or whatever out i'm not really sure what that's called but um on to the next screenshot all right so this one is the um i guess character selection that's what the little middle button on the top left is um so I'm guessing you have your bronze and then your silvers and then your golds, as you see um, in the, like, the little bottom left of each player card. Um, each one of those has a different class. I'm not really sure which one corresponds to which, but um, you have the on the bottom right, you have the, how much the ability cost um, and what the ability is and your health and damage on that I'm guessing you more uh, details um, not too much to the screen you see kind of all the character icons um, some of the, those are all, most of those are new actually we haven't uh, seen those released so that's an, that's uh, interesting but that is um, so all the screenshots for today there is more on the um, if you go look on the game lost Twitter they link the uh, entire Q&A there's not there's not too much more interesting things just some basic questions um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, it's just kind of a long video. Let me know if you guys like these. I can uh, definitely do some more. Um, and there's still no release date, so once that comes out, I'm pretty sure everyone will be posting videos on that. And it'll be a, a huge deal. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys in the video tomorrow. It's probably going to be a scrim versus someone. I'm not sure yet who, but I will see you guys in that video. Peace.